Tennessee end of course practice test, question number 19. It's for Algebra 1. Katie rented a moving truck. The total cost included a one-time fee of $40 and 75 cents for each mile driven. Which equation represents the total cost in dollars of renting a truck that was driven in miles? Now, if you just put the N value in front of this, it would look significantly like this, which is, of course, slope-intercept form. What the number by itself represents is something you pay regardless of uh, how much you actually use the item. So in this case it says that she pays a one-time fee of forty dollars. If you see one time anywhere you need to look for that number by itself. So this one has forty by itself and so does this one. This one has forty with a number. That's not a one-time fee. Same here. No. So it's either A or B already off the top. Now it says she uh, pays 75 cents for each mile that she drives. So it's either going to be divide by the number of miles or multiply. So let's just be logical about it. If I have 75 cents, I know that 2.75 cents is uh, $1.50, so let's divide by 2. Well, that doesn't give me $1.50, does it? But multiplying does. Uh, 1.5 is $1.50, so your answer is just A. It's actually really simple. Look for one-time fee, find that number by itself, and then 75 cents for each mile driven, and you're good.